All right, it is a cold ass day in New York, but I got a bunch of shit to do, stuff to do. Whoops, it's my language out here. Fashion week's coming up, headed to Hugo Boss right now. Gonna get a little fitting in so I can go to the show wearing some Hugo Boss. It's a front row, you know how it goes. <laughs> Just fun to do, so cool. And then uh, gonna get a workout in, crush some work, and then I got a DJ for the Young Collectors Night tonight at the Park Avenue Armory, which is a dope space. So get on board, folks. It's another day in New York. the Hugo Boss they got me coming to is in the Oculus. Probably one of the most impressive buildings in Manhattan right now. Maybe the world. This place is crazy. New York City, baby. Nice to How meet you doing? You. Thank you so much. Oh, of course. So See you, like, uh, luck. yeah, I love it. No. Boom, in and out. I don't mess around. Nice to meet good people that work at good brands, to be honest. I don't come across a lot of bad people, but it just makes everyone's life easier. Anyway, dopest. Back to the office. It's so cold out here. I wish. I can describe it, so I had to grab the old bone broth. I don't know if you guys are consuming bone broth, but Hannah put me on and chocks full of goodness, protein. It's like just a cup of soup. Get on the program. Also currently pondering the thought, why don't I live in Miami? Zero income tax, warm weather all year. It's not New York though, you know? I don't know if I can do it. Oh boy. Whoa. All right. Had to hit a midday gym sesh. I'm pretty sore from a couple days of working out. Currently rolling my back out. And... I'm not gonna bore you with this whole workout, but I'm gonna do a full video of a workout that I do with Kira on the regular soon. Stay tuned for that, but here's a few clips. The skier's a bitch. I think guess me. Tell you the truth, I'm not feeling that well, so sweating it out with Kira. <laughs> You're doing this next. Yeah, it's... <laughs> All right. Just did some aerodyne bikes. If you don't know what those are, yeah. Hell, I've been training with Kira for how long? We've been training together. Two years. Now? Two years. Two years. My arms still don't look like that. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> She also loves to tan, by the way. But you'd be so lucky to find someone like this in your life. This person has changed I'll my love. life dearly. I love. And I can't thank her enough. Aww. And this is what I get in return. <laughs> <laughs> that's it, that's all. But this yeah. one, my day continues. <laughs> thank you. We're gonna love do a you. full video with you. Yes. Let's do it. Yes. All right. Abiento. Safe flight, Ronya. As always, make sure you have a smoothie. After your workouts today, I'm trying this bone broth, keto protein, vanilla, 
as always. Never had it. Hopefully it's good. About to find out. That's good. Also, as you know, I'm not feeling amazing, so dethine some more broth from Brodo. Trying to have that before I DJ in that. Get better, hopefully. All right, crush a little work. Now I'm about to go do some actual work. Manual labor work, DJing. Brooks Brothers. I kind of feel like my dad right now. Stylish man, by the way. You'll see him in some of these videos. He's always looking good, but uh, yeah. It's been a while since I've worn a uh, gingham shirt. Feeling all right, though. It, ladies and gentlemen, Brooks Brothers ready. No matter what you think about a brand, if you can pull off whatever you want to wear confidently, there you go. Wear it like you mean it. I'm telling you, I'm really not mad at this look though. I feel like I could grow into this and be a little more mature sometimes. Oh, home photo. Our friend Steven Sampang shot this of us at Hotel du Cap, one of our favorite hotels in the world. Blew it up, had it framed. That piece is one for the books. Also low key, but I don't know if any of you have ever heard of Hodinkee or been to their offices, but I think I could slide in one day there incognito in this outfit. Kind of the uniform over there, to be honest. I have to try and pull this one off. Stay tuned for another episode where I do that. Hmm. You here for Brendan? Hey, how you doing? For Brendan? Yeah, sure. Nice to meet you. Couple photos in the old step and repeat there. Now I gotta go find my post. This place looks like a dope trade show. For a quick change, get out of this dad outfit. Head back out in town. So that's pretty fun though. I haven't DJed in it feels like since November or something. Long ass time. Pretty fun. Glad to be back behind it. I'm doing a Grammy's official after party on Sunday. I don't know if you'll see this before then, but I had to brush up on the skills. Now I'm gonna get my wife, eat some food. Check out a birthday party. Cheers, guys. I Very love small glasses. <laughs> we just rolled into Alicia Keys' birthday. Oh! Man went down. And uh, Swizz threw a roller skating party for this girl. So we're all about to roller skate. Let you know how this goes. You ready? No, I can't wait, bro. <laughs> Alicia's surprise birthday. She's about to walk in. See what happens. As you can see, wasn't up there for the surprise, but kind of addicted to the skate right now. Woo! I really, really need everybody that's up there to come down here to cool Steve Stout. Y'all got no fucking socks on with his Gucci slips on. I need you to the floor. 
Skates. We were moving and grooving, like I've moving never, and grooving. I've never seen you even. You were That's like, right. These feet were. It was insane. This. Oh. Oh. That was the reality Pure of the night. Magic. It was great. Give me a five. I'm a roller skating professional. It's actually outrageous. <laughs> Might be my hockey skills back in Canada. Not really sure, but you heard it here first. I might be the next roller rink. I, you honestly, how can you be a professional on something you've just tried? It's my first day. It's really crazy. You were like... <laughs> anyway, maybe yeah. that's another episode. Who knows? Good night, ladies and gentlemen.